is all how she left her stuff. Carmen and Michael Ojeda were crushed when their 11 year old daughter Brianna died after a severe asthma attack in 2010. I had turned down a one way street. A cop stopped Carmen minutes from the hospital. And he says, I don't know CPR. I don't do CPR. And I don't know CPR. Seven years after Brianna's death, her parents got the law changed. So now all police get trained. My pain is what pushes me forward. So when a Bronx teen named Junior was killed last summer, the Ojeda's attended vigils to comfort his mom, and they talked with a community advocate about starting a national foundation in Brianna's name for CPR training. Uh, ask me for assistance, and guess what? I deliver, and I'm not with my hand out. Clark Pena is host of a weekly web show. He introduced the Ojeda's to lawyer Zaki Tamir. The parents selected me to be the CEO. Brianna's parents say they were led to believe a wrongful death case could be resurrected. He told me that he's going to bring him $5,000. The father says he had already sent $2,500 to a lawyer in Minnesota to incorporate his daughter's foundation. He claims Zaki Tamir told him to get the money back and says Tamir made big promises in a room full of men. There was um, like seven people there. And he's telling me that this gentleman's worth a half a billion dollars. We'll have more than $2 million within 48 hours. He said he's the CEO. He wants 10%. Tamir made good on setting up the Brianna Lives Foundation with the New York Department of State, with Clark Pena helping to create a logo and T-shirts. Pena also introduced the parents to prominent public officials. The group even honored a local cop who saved a baby with CPR. Mr. Ojeda says that the lawyer Tamir said Clark Pena has to get paid as well. That's something that you have to ask uh, the attorney. The lawyer, Zaki Tamir, did not return our calls requesting an interview. Within two weeks of meeting Tamir, Michael Ojeda decided he felt something wasn't right and fired him. He also asked for the bulk of his money back. Instead, Brianna's parents claim they received a four-page bill from Tamir for more than $7,000 in early September. It included a charge of $1,680 on the day the lawyer went to what's called a promo taping on Clark Pena's show. The parents believed they were appearing alone. They look for people that are vulnerable. Clark Pena says he walked away from the foundation because the parents got combative. You can Google me, I'm everywhere. I don't hide. For what? For what? You hide when you're guilty. Uh, I have no reason to hide from anyone. All I've done is help people. I'm Mary Murphy, PIX11 News.